That is taken care of. I'm up to 208, so let's get out of here because these slimes are picking on me. So, let's now explore the town of Old On. This is another new town for us. Let's see what is available here. Let's make sure I have the proper thing equipped this time, yeah? That's probably going to be useful. There we go, all the way to the right. And then another empty room, how dare you? All the way to the right again, so that we can find this guy. Buy some of my laurels? No, I'm good. Thank you, though. Did not use one accidentally around here, so I think I'm fine for the time being. We'll see how much time I have left before it turns to night again, and I just need to start killing everything that I see. Uh, looks like I can just head up here, because there is nothing more than another staircase. Oh, this one goes on for a bit. But I do want to fully explore this place, so we might as well go in a counterclockwise manner. Sure. When I was your age, women loved me. Well, apparently, women love me, too. And I'll be back. I didn't even get a heal, but I should be fine here in town. Nothing too bad. And it is morning again, so let us run around and see if we can't find anything good. Notice that I did get a level up during my grinding. How you doing, buddy? What? He stopped right at the... Right, right when I was trying to talk to him. Dig up the fourth grave in the cemetery for a diamond. I, I got one. Do I need two? How many diamonds do I need? A man living in darkness can give your whip power. A man living in darkness, you say? Can I just have the power? I have to go find him, huh? You don't know the secret to the power? It's not something that's spread around too much? Yeah, when I was your age, the women couldn't stop beating down my door, kept on asking me for a date, and I was like, no, stay back, vile woman, I have Dracula to kill. No, wait, that's what I did. All right, we'll head over to the left then. Old man up here. You can tell he's old because he's got a cane and possibly a beard. A little difficult to say. Take my daughter, please. I've never had so many women thrown at me as I have in this game. And I've played Mass Effect. Uh, what is in here? Death? Not death. Maybe I should have kneeled just to make sure. But I was pretty confident that I couldn't die inside a building in town. But I can head over here. Stop. Morning Star? Buy one! Yes, I will! This is an upgrade to the whip, as you can see from the little whip icon there. 200 for that! Uh, I guess it, it looks like the same whip, uh, except that it's got more of a Morning Star at the end of it. It's got a little spike. That is an upgrade to the whip! I am happy to get it! So let us leave. This is a man in darkness, apparently. Looks like a normal shop to me. Let's just head on. No, stop stopping. Believe in magic and you'll be saved. Is he trying to proselytize on me? All right, let's head down. A little bit more work for us to do. Nothing too important though. I can actually head left, can't I? I don't think I actually want to do that though. Let's head here. Turn right for Saddam Woods, left for the Jam Wasteland. Nothing quite like the, the Jam Wasteland. All right, let's move on. Now that I do have the Morning Star, I'm feeling pretty confident about things. Hey, it's an old woman, how you doing? Don't look into the Death Star or you will die. All right, we're leaving that alone because I'm trying my best to think of a joke, but no, oh, is it? I think it's just a Star Wars reference. No, it means something. I swear. Don't make me stay. I'll die. Yeah, if only you could figure out how to drop down a little bit. I think. No, 
Oh, it has to mean something. That is, that's what I'm, like, debating back and forth. All I can think of is, like, the Death Star, you know? Not... It's, it's gotta be a thing, right? Like, the Death Star was, was definitely a thing by the time this game came out. Star Wars is a surprisingly old movie, considering. But, still, like... We're moving on. That's why I wouldn't, that's why I didn't say anything to begin with. God, that takes a lot of holy water to kill those guys. Let's head to the right though. And this time we will head down the stairs. But if I could find the stairs that is. I don't know what was going on there. Let's just head down. Not, not there. I wanna head over here, see if there's a hidden f thing for me. Yeah, that's a, that's a recovery right here. All right, let's start throwing holy water. Where is it? All right, those two? Ha! There we go. Looks fine, but I'm gonna jump for it just in case. All right, so there. Looks good. Looks good. Let's... Just jump for it just in case. And all the way across where there's a horrible night and we have another curse. Am I actually jumping? I'm gonna let go of everything. All right, apparently I was not jumping. Let's head over here where we can find more hands. Hands. Reaching up from nothing. As long as I'm not moving, I should be okay. But then there's slimes and I, like, I jumped where he was good at. The damn slimes. The other ones were easier. No, they take two hits still. Damn freaking slimes. They're the worst. The ones in the Berkeley Mansion were easy by comparison. All right, so I have not been counting the graves. I should have been counting the graves. Damn it, hold on. Yeah, I don't need to count the graves here. So, we're just going to head to the end and we're going to equip the garlic. Throw that. Look who showed up. I'll give you a silk bag. And we have received the silk bag. It is not a normal item. It shows up uh, right uh, next to our morning star, our whip name. There's the silk bag there. It allows us to take more hits. So we get less damage done to us over time as a result of having the silk bag. I probably will need that. Uh, we're done here in the graveyard. Ah, almost. Almost got off. Damn it. Almost got off scot-free there, but I did not. Kill more of the hands. The hands are clearly the deadliest enemy around here. But we will continue on. No, I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for it. One, two, three, four. It looked like four there. So let's head up. I don't have the most health, but I don't think I necessarily need all the health in the world moving forward, hopefully. No! All right, down you go. Let's head to the right. Damn it, slimes. Slimes everywhere! Maybe I need all the health I could get. For whatever reason, though, felt like I need to keep a laurel. Let's head to the right. We can make it back to town. Now, this town did not have a church. So we will just head up and head through. I was kind of lucky that that thing died in one hit because they didn't normally. So no, no church here. So we're just gonna have to go for it. Head over to the right. Hopefully the, uh, the morning sun does show up because yes, everything is closed at night, even though the door is open. Still closed. All right, yeah, I don't need that equipped. Hey, the morning sun has vanquished 
The horrible night. Hooray! Let's go talk to the ferryman. He doesn't care if it's day or night. Sure, I'll take you to a good place. Heh <laughs> heh. Heh heh heh. There's three heads. Please don't let them hit me. All right, we're good here. Jump off. With our upgrades, we are hopefully good to go. Let's head to the right. I do need to use the laurel here. I don't really have a choice about that. Just walk across. It technically makes you invisible. Ugh. Of course, of course. But it does make you temporarily invincible as well. I hate those things. As you can see, come on, we're gonna make it. We're gonna make it all the way back to Jova. I didn't technically need to come here, but I wanted to because I freaking need a heal, as you can clearly see. So hopefully we can make it all the way back without it turning to night on me. It really shouldn't, but you never know. All right, back up here and we get ourselves a heal. Rest here for a while. All the way back up and we can head back down and we can head back the way that we came. I need to go to another mansion. This one is the one that we passed earlier. We'll head back once we put on Dracula's heart and take the ferryman to, once again, let's call it the good place because it's the place that I'm supposed to go that first time. All right, can I kill these guys in one hit? Sweet. Now I feel a lot better taking care of it. Screw it, I'm gonna use another Laurel. Just run for it. This time, hopefully nothing knocks me back into the swamp. I time it just so I can make it. All right, Dracula's heart equipped. Let's head out. Let me show you the way and we're off. Don't hit me. I don't want to get knocked off the raft. And we hop out. Put the rib back on. And we're good to go. We're good to go for now, at least. And we've made it to another mansion. We will head into this mansion next time. That is going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Castlevania 2 Simon's Quest. I've been Baller Scoop. I've been joined, as always, by the upgraded Simon Belmont. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.